CIF Football Championship, all because of Dave Curry. It is a great honor to be associated with him, and it's a great honor to introduce Dave Curry. I thought these guys were good players. I didn't know they could talk. <laughs> we would have let them take their helmets off if we knew they could speak. Uh, I'm actually overwhelmed about being here, and I, I want to say uh, to all you ladies that are putting up with this endless evening, thank you for your patience and your tolerance. And if you hang in there, you'll probably get to go home with the guy that brought you. <laughs> uh, last night was a nostalgia to me. Uh, I went to, uh, I, I was in a late meeting on campus and I got started late in my car, so I spent four hours on the freeway coming to Ventura, so I went right to the stadium last, over at Ventura College. And going into the stadium, I saw these two teams lined up to play. And on one side was this group in green and large numbers and organized and talented and quick and fast. And then on the other side was a group not so large, organized, and talented. And it kind of brought back some memories. I thought St. Bonaventure was on the other side. <laughs> because when I left St. Bonaventure, that's, that's how we all looked. No one gave a hoot about us. <laughs> but the nostalgia of the evening was amazing. Uh, uh, the third quarter, I, I left with uh, uh, Judge O'Neill. We walked out of the stadium. It was 50 to nothing in St. Bonaventure. And, I was beginning to feel badly for that other little group on this, uh, this side of the field because some of us had been there. And so we walked out of the stadium, we talked a little bit about the evening, and then I took the walk uh, down the street, it was dark, I got in my car and I drove over to St. Bonaventure, I, I don't know what made me do this, but as I said, it's nostalgia. Uh, I pulled in to the parking lot and the gate was open from the church lot to the gym. And I just pulled back here like I used to do with the driver ed cars. Uh, Father, Father Meskel gave me a driver ed car if I got him one. So I pulled in the back here and I pulled up and it was dark and I turned my lights off, got out of the car, walked up on the field and it was just, uh, it was an amazing feeling. And I can't uh, express it in so many words, but a lot of memories came back. First of all, it's, I could smell the grass. And, and, I'm, and there wasn't any grass on the field. It's artificial <laughs> turf. But, but I, I, could, I could smell it. I could feel it. I could feel the days that 42 years ago that we were on that field. And the first thing I thought about was the time that we were out on the practice field and one of the parents had come up to me and said, Coach, a couple of your players were out drinking last night. You need to address it. Fine, we're, we're going to build a pride unit here. We're not going to tolerate anybody that doesn't want to follow the team rules. So I go up to the team and I said, all right, guys, I want the, the people involved in that drinking incident in my office right after practice. And until that happens, we're not going to practice. We're not going to play. We're not going to put a uniform on. Well, the coaches and I, Coach Little and Coach Luna, we walked down and said, we're going to get those two suckers. We'll kick their butts and, and then we'll get on and go play. Bishop, Bishop O'Dowd, uh, Bishop Diego, excuse me, I still don't like him. <laughs> so we're in our office and the two guys coming in drinking to confess, no, there's 13 guys walking. We got half our football team comes in and confesses. And so I, I, I remember that last night up there in that field because I remember the time that uh, Bill Stolp's lying in a, an ambulance after a hot day and I remember the the, the whipping we took up there, but we really grew as a football team because it was just one incident of where we decided as a group of guys, we're going to do things the right way. And if we didn't do them the right way, we're, going, we're not going to get to play. And I could go on and on like you, you can tonight and talk about illustrations that bring out teamness in you, but you talk about a group that built a lot of pride. Well, that was the beginning. And then I walked down the field dark at night and 